And a majority of those homes are located just east of Kamii. Many of them, like this one behind me, fell victim to flames on Friday because of those high winds. Now the people living here left picking up the pieces. You can't make out how this house used to look, but you can feel for the people who called it a home. It's one of 42 that burned in the Clearwater Complex fire, and officials fear there could be more. Meanwhile, the fight for containment continues. Today, there's more resources. Helicopters circle the sky, searching for spots needing water. But still, locals are pitching in. Judy Oatman and her daughter are stopping cars heading up Beaver Slide Road. They're making sure that people coming through have a reason to be there because they've been having a problem with looting. Judy says her house survived. Every day I ask myself, if we're, are we crazy to still be here? But if we don't stay and fight for it, it's gone. She's hopeful, but adds that they need more help.